Hi friends, welcome back to Paula MJ's Place. My name is Paula. Um, I am going to be uploading two videos. One is a walkthrough, my first walkthrough. Sorry, my shirt here. Um, I'm not sure which one I'll upload first, but I'm going to have be wearing the same stuff because, you know, I had a busy day today. I got to tell you, I went the first thing in the this morning. I went for, uh, to get a radiology thing at like eight o'clock. I come out of my out of there at 8.30 and somebody keyed my car. Keyed it! I have scratches all over my car from people doing that, but this is a big one. I was so upset. It like ruined my whole day. Then I had a dentist appointment. I get to the dentist. He's like, well, we can make it this or that, but you're going to have metal showing. I'm like, I don't want metal showing. Well, the plastic is not going to... I have a headache from this day. Then I went to the Dollar Trees. Then I got a haircut. And here I am. So... I'm sorry about the rant. I just that ruined my day. Why do people do that kind of stuff? I mean, really? Uh, anyway, moving on, moving on. Welcome. Um, if you enjoy my videos, I would appreciate it if you haven't subscribed yet to please consider subscribing. I'm hoping to get to 500 subscribers really soon. Please share, like, make sure you watch all the way through. Ooh, I see shadow here. <laughs> Um, I heard, I think it was Donna from Donna's Deals and DIYs said that um, in order to monetize, you only have to have 500 subscribers, but you have to have 3,000 uh, viewing hours. I have nowhere close to that. I'm almost at 500 subscribers, so I mean one hurdle at a time, I guess. Anyway, um, yeah, so don't forget to watch my uh, walkthrough video, my first one. Yeah, <laughs> without further ado. Here's my Dollar Tree haul, y'all. <laughs> okay, I found a lot of fall stuff. You'll see them in the walkthrough. Um, I did get a few things for myself that I just could not resist. Oh, I'm looking at this pumpkin. They have these, this is, says Harvest on it. And it's a garden steak, but it's got beads. Look at that. And it says, I don't know if you can see that, Harvest. Um, am I holding it? Oh, this way. Harvest raised lettering. I'm not really crazy about this, right? This coloring right here at all. I don't know if I want to change that. Uh, they had so many different ones. I got two. I got this one and I got the orange one, which is exactly the same except it's orange. And it just, uh, it says garden steak. And I can measure this for you. It's going to be, uh, let's see, 12. Well, it should say on here. I think it's 24 inches. Yeah, it's going to be 24 inches. 12 and 12. Yeah, about 24 inches. Aren't these nice, though? Look at the beads. That's what got me. I don't really care about garden stakes that much. Unless it's the pinwheels. But those beads got me, you guys. They had other colors. You'll see them in the walkthrough. Um, yeah, so I got two of these. And they had corn, too. But I was trying to film the walkthrough and trying to get the corn. And I just I don't think I got all the ones I wanted to get. This is a garden steak as well. But look at the corn. And the beads are gradient. Do you see that? Like, the, they're darker brown and then lighter brown. Isn't that cute? I should have got more. Aw. That's about 24 inches as well. And that says garden steak. Okay. And then I... This is, this, I got a, just a floral bouquet of zinnias. Love this color. I love these flowers because of their, the way they, you know, they're so pretty like in a wreath or anywhere you put them because they just stay like splayed out like that. And I think some of these are a little bit, whatever. But I saw just this one bouquet and it's my color. So I got it. <laughs> um, I also got this um, chalkboard paint in black. I have some. I don't use it that often. I, sometimes I use it to distress. I did do a few DIYs with some crosses I had. Um, so yeah, this is the chalk chalkboard paint. I believe you can write on this paint. I just use it to distress. But like I said, um, I have one, but I've had it for years. I went to use it yesterday and it was kind of drying out. This, this is real chalkboard paint. It says right here, create usable, chalkboard surfaces with chalkboard uh, paint. Simply brush paint into a porous project, um, onto a porous project surfaces, let dry and then condition with chalk. Oh, okay, perfect for adding uh, 
an area for list messages. Oh, that's pretty cool. I thought it was, but I never really paid attention. And everything I'm showing you is $1.25. We have no plus, excuse me, no plus stores in our area yet. Um, I got these color forms, four in one fashion dress up scenes. These are dolls. <laughs> yeah, I got them because I love color forms. I remember when I was little, it was like a like a felt kind of material, but I wanted to try these. I already took one out and I dressed her up. I'll show you. They have you have four different dolls <clears throat> with each one has 20 uh, color forms on them. So this is so cute. So you got your doll and there's two sides, like two scenes, and then you have your color forms here which are, there's 20 of them, and you see them right here, and there, you just peel it off. It's like a plastic. I'll show you, because I already dressed up my doll, but that's for that one. I didn't put shoes on her because I didn't finish, but there's her, her dress, comes off. See, so peel it right off. I love this. I remember being in school and having these. And then this one, I dressed her up with the blue, uh, is that blue? Blue, and then look at the shoes, and I put a little flower on her hair. How cute is that? And you got more you can pick from here, and that's only one of the dolls. Now, they had a whole, a long horizontal one with just one scene and different dolls, but I thought this one was cute because you could pick, um, you know, you can do different dolls, and you can, just, it's like handier, I guess. I don't know. It's not as cumbersome. Anyway, I'm just putting this back in here because if I don't do this now, I will lose it. And so cute. Really cute. So yeah. And then, oh, I got this. I hadn't seen these for a while. It's 11 by 14 canvas panel. There's no wood, it's not framed, it's just a canvas. But I have that map I bought last week. I'm thinking, I don't know, maybe I put it on here and frame it. I don't know. I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> I got this again, the bathroom cleaner. Um, the bathroom cleaner, not so much. I'm not really. <laughs> this, I got it for this thing because I use Clorox cleanup. And every single tr trigger of every single one of those bottles that comes with the cleanup, I have to use it a few times. It doesn't, it doesn't, squ like you squeeze it and it stays squeezed or squoze I don't know and you have to keep popping the handle back so you could spray again and then I try to put it in an old fantastic bottle same thing um, but I put some of it in one of these bottles that I had uh, <laughs> sorry that I had hauled before and it's working pretty good so this one is for the upstairs bathroom and they have um, some with just the refills. I did get one with just the refills. It's still in the cabinet. I tried it. It's not all that. But yeah, that's what that's for. And then I did get these. I don't know if these are new. This is the Wizard Magic of Fresh Tropical. These are scented beads, I believe. They have two different scents. Um, I think they might have had these a few years back. I'm not sure. What got me was the pineapple looking thing. I'm going to put my glasses on so I can actually see. Sorry if my makeup's messed up. I went for a haircut and then I have to kind of get all that hair off and wash my hair again. Um, it says, explore paradise with relaxing scent of tropical citrus by Wizard. Crystal beads air freshener. That's what it is. And this is tropical citrus. So that is cute. And I was using the Renews It. Um, and I was getting it from Dollar Tree. I actually don't want to open that until I... But you can't smell anything from it. I was getting it from Dollar Tree, the dollar something. But then I found out Walmart had it for 99 cents. You know, the solid. So he was getting it at Walmart. And then all of a sudden it was like $1.50. So I quit getting that. I do the Airwick plugins. Those used to be like 12 something before the pandemic. The refills. They're 17 something. I'm like, ain't no way. No, 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 no. Ain't no way. I'll try this. Um, yeah, this one is called Morning Mist. And these are the only two that I had, that I had, that they had, Dollar Tree had. These only two that I saw, the scents. 
I thought they were really cute. Um, somebody said, I heard someone say somewhere, they did nothing for their bathroom. I saw someone, I don't know where it was, don't buy those, they do nothing for small bathrooms. I don't know. And I did get this all-purpose scrubber. I thought it was really cr cr cute. Scrub Buddies. Um, I'm sure they've had this all along, but I saw it on, I don't know, some really famous channel. I forgot. She's got like a million, a million subscribers. Um, I don't, I forgot, totally it blanked out. Anyway, she was showing this, that it's, uh, it does not scratch, and it has the little handle, so you could have a good grip on it to clean. There we go. See, and then, it, you know, you could rinse it out and whatnot, and I like the little handle, and it's just the Scrub Buddies um, all-purpose scrubber. Cleans without scratching, and it is the Dollar Tree uh, Green Briar product. And then, ah, uh, they had all different ones. You'll see them in the walkthrough. I pref I would have preferred to get the orange one, but the the saying on it was not the one I wanted. So I got the purple one. Give, I mean the purple one. I wish the green one. Give thanks. Look at that. It's like a little rolling pin. How cute is that? It's tabletop decor. I figure I'll put this on a tear tray. I do not need any more decor anymore. I had those little signs that said um, hot apple cider, pumpkin pie, apple pie. This is 10 and a half inches. I had it in my cart and I put it back. I just can't. I can't do that. Two and uh, one, two, two and three eighths up and down, uh, this way. That is the cutest thing. Alrighty, and then I found one lone jelly scissors. I can't believe I found it. I was like, it was just thrown somewhere. So I have not seen them at all in my area anywhere. They're like jelly. They're squeezable, and they are Westcott's too. It says it right there. I think it says it on the top, yeah. Blunt tip, ages four and up. I'm just a kid at heart, you all. I am just a kid at heart. Oh, and I did get these Jot push pins, 15 in a pack. I was rearranging my bulletin board in the office, and I wanted all of my push pins to look nice. It was kind of, everything on there was kind of a little bit jumbled up, so I wanted to use these. I had some already, but I think I have only one left, so I want this for my stash. These are really pretty, they're like a pearl. And there's 15 in there. They're not new, they had them last year. They were new last year, I think. Oh, and this is another full thing I wanted. I think I'll put this in my coffee bar. Cinnamon mold wine. It's like a little jug, a little wine jug. Excuse me for a second. Sorry about that. Okay, yeah, so cinnamon mold wine. This is the one I got. Mold, not mold, whatever I said. Um, and they had another one, you'll see it in the walkthrough. That's going to be a separate video, by the way, because it's too long. Noisy people. Okay, tabletop decor. It's so cute, and since my kitchen is wine and coffee, this does say cinnamon mold wine. I'm going to keep it out all year long. Spring, summer, fall, y'all. Doesn't matter because I like it. Uh, the widest point is going to be four and a one eighth of an inch. I don't even remember if I already measured this before all we were so rudely interrupted. Uh, six and a half up and down. That's so cute. Love, love, love. I think the other one said apple cider. I'm not sure. Um, so yeah, I did get all of the fall things I wanted. Now I'm regretting not getting the little scroll apple pie hot but I don't have anywhere to put it. What is wrong with me? Okay, finally found the double bubble gumball in the dreamsicle. Dreamsicle, yum, oh. So I got that. I'm not gonna do a taste test because I have something else for a taste test. Um, Y'all, you know, you'll see it in, in the walkthrough there. They have the pretzels, the buffalo wings and all kinds, but I didn't get them. And I was gonna get, um, the, the, the ones like I got last week, the cinnamon ones, some more, I didn't get those either. I'm 
trying to cut down, but I did see these hot chipotle peanuts, the planters ones, and I just have to try these, y'all. These are 170 calories per serving. There are six servings in the can, and one serving is one ounce. So I like, you know me, I like everything hot and spicy, so I figured even if I have a small handful a day, I think I'll be okay. Let's dig in, shall we? <laughs> really? I want to cut myself. Okay. They smell like peanuts. I mean, they don't smell like any other flavor. They look like it would be chipotle. Okay, hot chipotle. Mmm, hot. Oh, yeah. I meant to get a napkin. I did. Mmm. Huh. These are good. They're spicy. For sure. But they're good. Man, I'm getting really well with all these um, new new food products. <laughs> That's good. I give that a nine. Two thumbs up. Okay, y'all. That's it for my video. I did not take any pictures because I have to walk through, which will be a separate video. I'll probably up be uploading them um, that video tomorrow, depending on how quickly this one can get uploaded. Anyway, <laughs> excuse me. It's not that hot. I just had <laughs> to swallow. I appreciate you all. Thank you so much for sticking with me um, and for watching my videos. Don't forget, um, like, share, comment. If you have anything, anything you want to add, anything that you're looking for, uh, anything I found that you have found too and you have a different opinion of it, like any food stuff, let me know. And thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you all. Until next time, be well and be blessed.